it looks like midwinter again. This is actually March 17. And there's just the faintest skim of slush on the pond because it's snowing again. But the ice is gone. So you can see the fish, especially the koi, because they're big and they stand out. But the fish have done well, despite our polar vortex. I don't think we've lost any. The waterfall is still falling. It ran pretty much uninterrupted all winter. Helped kept the pond from freezing over completely. Which, of course, helps keep the fish alive and healthy. So our system is able to withstand extremely cold weather. Which is always nice. Hello, Sunny. Amalfi is the big white one in the back. It's Sunny. This is the Chikoi. And the huge flock of goldfish. And even though it reached into the 50s and the 60s, I did not see any frogs yet this year. So they either were not fooled by the brief warm-up, which isn't uncommon in Indiana, not in the Northwest, or you might have had a dip in our frog population. You do have a bullfrog, and they do have a tendency to run out other species of frogs and eat them when they're, they have the opportunity. They'll also eat some of these smaller fish and birds. They can catch the smaller birds. So we will have to keep an eye on that. I try to relocate the bullfrogs, but they always seem to find us again. Not sure why, but they do. They like the pond. Hello, fishies.